Governor Doug Burgum is vetoing another bill attempting to reform his emergency powers. The latest bill would have installed automatic triggers for a special session if federal funds, like the CARES Act, needed approval and distribution. If the state received a federal package worth less than $3 million, the Emergency Commission could have approved its use without changes from lawmakers. If the package were $3 million to $50 million, the budget section could approve and change where the dollars go. If a federal aid package is worth more than $50 million, state lawmakers would have required uh, a special session. North Dakota lawmakers are expected to wrap up their work by the end of the week. Some of the late changes to bills are echoes of previously failed efforts. Lawmakers inserted an amendment banning vaccine passports in North Dakota, with exceptions for health care providers and airports. Some were hesitant to take on the amendment because it takes away a business's ability to decide for itself. I know we're all worried about, can I get on the plane? We can't affect that. No matter what we do here in the state, it's only within our borders, but it does seem to give people some um, comfort level, I guess. The committee voted unanimously to add the ban after saying it balances the rights of businesses and the rights of the person. The House failed a late bill that tried to do the same thing. That attempt needed two-thirds majority to be considered. This latest attempt only requires a simple majority from both chambers. The Bison are headed back to Texas, but not to Frisco, at least not yet. Up next, what they have planned for this weekend's game in Huntsville.